Hey guys, Tolo here, and uh, let's continue on our journey towards level 85. This is uh, episode 24 of uh, Let's Play World of Warcraft, and uh, thanks for hopping along. Yep, so we are level 34 at the moment, and we'll get working right away. We need to go and kill a Mori, a Fitztittle, Wretching something wrench. And yep, from Jewel Mirror, we need that as well. So we got plenty of stuff to do. That will be uh, right up here by the uh, Troll Ruins, the Naga place. And yeah, so let's get the uh, writing. And it seems like only six more levels, and we'll get our second mount. That means we'll get the mount that uh, rides with a hundred percent speed. I'm so looking forward to that mount. Uh, it's gonna make the job a lot easier. So, if um, you guys haven't uh, seen it yet, I some of you guys, I've seen a few of you guys uh, saying that I should go uh, Affliction Warlock, but apparently uh, you didn't watch the last couple of episodes because I have become a Affliction Warlock while I'm leveling and uh, loving it. I love playing an Affliction Warlock. It's awesome. So, uh, yeah, I'm a Affliction Warlock now. That uh, I've been that for a few episodes. And then that helps out a lot. Oh well, that's the goblin that we need to kill. Free wheel in uh, John's fist titles. What a name. <laughs> Let's put the dot up here. We'll, we'll have to wait. Because we don't want to run. I think we need to loot some from him. From him. From him. There we go. Let's dice him. And yeah. Over there, we got another guy. We'll need to kill that guy as well. That's a night elf. He, he looks like a night elf druid of some sort. Must be an evil one, corrupted maybe. Oh, look at that! We got a monkey on us. Let's start it up. Start it up, and it shouldn't be that hard to kill. And he's dead. Now I only need one more item, that should be further up the uh, the beach by the uh, Nagas. Uh, he's a zombie goal, something like that, if I remember correctly. Oh, there he is. They, the NPCs did move a little bit since the old days and the pre tpc days. So, but not too far. Still the, almost the same people we need to kill. Uh, at least this guy is the same person that we have to kill compared to the uh, old days. There we go, killed him straight away. N no problem at all. So now we let's get go to Booty Bay and deliver our two quests. Yes, we do have two quests because we completed one quest the last time as well. That means we'll can, we can turn it in for like 7,000 uh, 8,000 XP, that's awesome. But that, that's nowhere near. That it helps on a, us a, a little bit with the XP, not too much, like 20%. Uh, but that's all right. Hopefully, we'll get some more quests that will bring us forward to uh, level uh, 35. Hopefully, we'll manage to hit level 35 in this episode. If not, I'll make sure we expand the episode too, so we get that uh, further in that level. And what is a level 82 running doing around here? Certainly couldn't be leveling, could he? <laughs> don't think so. Or doing low master either. I don't think that so either. Must have been doing archaeology or something. But that's still pretty strange to be doing a level 82. I mean, if it was me, I would probably wait for level 85 and then do archaeology at that point. And that re reminds me, I've still, I've yet to do my archaeology on my warrior and score, but I'm just simply too lazy. Don't find that find that any interesting. I'll uh, write the ship from Booty Pay to Wretched, then speak with Gastelov. Well, we'll do that afterwards, I guess. We'll deliver the quests here first and see what bring what it brings us towards to. We need to go to that island over in Horizon. Right over there, we can see him from straight from here. Oh well, we just saw him at least. 
Oh, another quest. Nice. And it's a few more quests up here. It certainly wasn't there the last time we went here. I need to pick up it. Damn it. Uh, that one sells the most to the winder. And look at that. We hit a new reputation with the... Uh, what was that? The... Uh, what did we... We gained friendly with Booty Bay. Awesome. awesome. Let's go upstairs and pick up the quests as well. And we might as well uh, abandon these uh, grey quests. We're not gonna need them anymore. Wasn't it up here? No? Oh, it's over there on the other side. That's great. That means we'll have to jump down. Right up here. Let's see what quests we got. Pick up this quest first. Uh, battle for Anderhol. Speak with War Mage uh, Rally to be teleported to Anderhol in Western Plague Lands. Then report to Terrasen within Anderhol. Well, I guess we could do that. That sounds kind of fun. Let's see what that brings us to. Hopefully, Western Plague Lands, since uh, Anderhol is located in Western Plague Lands. Oh, I love these quests. Let's do them. Just gotta need the NPC to be spawning. Oh, uh, yeah. Awesome, a few quests there. And we got a flight path up here. We better make sure to uh, pick it up, just so we can get it done. And yeah, we'll have to uh, kill some stuff, kill some more stuff, and kill some more stuff. That sounds like a plan. I guess we could just be mass uh, dotting up here, make the job a lot easier. Oh uh, yeah, dotting up is such easy. I wonder how many we can take without being a threat to us. We, I know we got the guards helping out, but I still shouldn't be that much of a problem. And let's do some AOE. That was nice. That got us a few kills. But not enough kills. We need to kill more. Oh, don't you want to die? Come on. And we need to kill some of the stuff up here. Let's send in our Void Walker first. That way he will take the aggro, I guess. Shouldn't... Meh. They don't have that much health, so it should be... Okay. Totally had more health than I expected. Or I, I did less damage than I expected. Okay. And they don't even give any XP. That's crap. Let's get uh, use this health stone here. There we go. That went smoothly, almost. Uh, we need to kill a few more down here, and we'll need to find more of these abomination and abominations and kill them as well. We'll need to find uh, five more abomination or four more, four more if you include this one. Set that it up. There's one abomination up there. Might as well use this uh, potion here. Maybe we should get a little bit of health before we continue pooling. There we go. Oh, uh, I like the thing, the way they did the, what they did to um, Anderhall here, that they made one uh, alliance part, one uh, horde part, and one scourge part. I really like the idea. It's like a mini version of the uh, Berlin uh, conflict that, that was uh, after World War Two. I like that. Maybe a little bit more cha chaotic uh, than. Uh, than uh, what it uh, was after the World War II, but uh, oh well, you got, get what I mean. It's 
pretty cool. Although I thought it would uh, make up for, make the brilliant place for some more world PvP going. Uh, but that part I got hugely, hugely uh, disappointed. I thought a lot more world PvP would be, uh, be done in uh, Cataclysm compared to this. But I guess, oh, that's not good, that's not good. Damn it. W what just happened there? Did I fail that badly? I guess I did. But I, I thought um, this place and the hall was going to be one of the places with lots of world PvP just because it was a, like a small questing hub where both Alliance and the Horde had to do. But uh, that didn't turn out to be. Neither did it with the Southern Barons either. And that place where you have the uh, Horde and the Alliance uh, um, looking uh, just in front of each other. I thought that would uh, introduce more world PvP as well, but I guess oh, they are not gonna it's kind of have become a um, non-existence world pvp and that habit uh, is a long gone habit it's not really existing that more and that much anymore and uh, i guess it's kind of kind of hard to change uh, habits like that uh, some something like that takes ages and uh, nowadays people are more focused around the uh, actually reward you get from uh, doing stuff and that's why they want to rather go to Battlegrounds, because they are more rewarding than uh, actually World PvP. Although in terms of fun, I guess, in my opinion, the uh, World PvP is much more fun. It's been a long time since I had uh, some awesome World PvP, to be honest. Well, I can always go to Top of Rod Penasolia, I guess, but that's not quite the same. If you ever experienced uh, Vanilla WoW with the uh, battles that went on between Astrona in uh, Ashen World and uh, Crossroads, or if you ever happen to uh, see the South Shore and Terran Mill and uh, Hillspread Foothills, then you would know what I mean. It was on at least, honestly a lot more fun than uh, a lot of the stuff you can do nowadays. And uh, yeah, while you're at it, uh, go to YouTube and search for Aliens Most Wanted. It's the most AP pre to see a PvP video ever. It's a... Uh, oh look at that, he grabbed me up on this uh, light pole here. <laughs> awesome. Um, that's the seriously the best uh, PvP video in pre or well, at least one of them. It uh, was a uh, world PvP at the least. It um, had uh, a bunch of alliance raiding the horde cities um, on the city at 3 a.m. And Thunder Bluff at 4 a.m. and then Ogremai at 5 a.m. I remember I was totally amazed by it. But I mean, 40 people think of it. 40 people attacking one of the major cities, and back then it was a lot harder to do that such a thing. And uh, I was really amazed back then, and it's still one of my favorite videos. Um, then again, the title was uh, Alliance Most Wanted. I'll most likely have the title linked in the uh, or the video linked to in the description below. So please check it out, it's pretty cool. Okay, so we need to get up to this tower. Use uh, this bump, I guess. Yeah, there we go. That was what we were supposed to do earlier, when uh, instead of uh, trying to tank and kill them all. Uh, let's uh, use the bump again. And again. And again, I guess we could just keep on this, so but uh, that wouldn't be fun, would it? There we go. Let's get out of here. Now I've got three quests completed, and that will make up for some nice XP. Like, about... 1300 XP. And that's... Pr no, that's almost enough to bring us towards the next level. Damn it, we're cl so close, ain't we? Let's uh, check it out. Just gonna deliver these quests right here, and yeah, we're not gonna make it, are we? Oh, a few more quests, awesome. That leads towards the instance uh, Shulmans, and no, it's not, not quite yet. Oh, let's uh, continue. We can simply ride through the map. But mobs here should be possible. Ah, damn it! 
Okay, I guess we have to kill you if it has to be like that. There we go. And ding, level 35. Awesome. Let's put our talent point. Where should we put, put it? Uh, yeah. Causes your field spell to inflate more. Blah, blah, blah. Increase your amount of mana awarded by your life to tap spell by 10%. I guess we could do that. Now we just need to find the life tap somewhere here. Um, where should I put it? I usually put it right there here there we go but i think i'm gonna cut off this episode re right here and i'll uh, continue on the next episode so uh, i'm gonna say thanks for watching and i'll see you next time bye